Hello guys again and now we will continue our project. So the last video uh, we finished on prepare our mm, working space, our working file and, and in this video we will continue but we will work more uh, about the sh uh, shape of our building. So as I said how to get uh, inside in our building in our project you should go to the project, open it, uh, find where your central file, just click on them and uh, don't forget about create new local and open up it and overwrite existing file every time, don't worry about that. Just few seconds and we are in, uh, in our project. But before we will uh, continue to create a uh, shape of our building, Let's have a look one more time uh, to our building. As you see, the exterior part, I mean balconies, is different. Uh, it's have the some like the spline you can see here. Uh, you can see more better here. But uh, what about the inside? About the core? It's totally same. As you, you can see clearly here. Look at the window. It's totally same. I not will copy even on 60% this building. I will just follow the principles of this building and that's it. So because maybe you're doing the, your own building. That's why it doesn't matter how it will be uh, look same or no. Okay, I need this image so I will save it. As you remember guys uh, how we saving. Uh, we need go to the into our folder. Mm, waste my folder tutorials and uh, photos and this is uh, level one and we need this one level two level two let's save it okay let's go back to our project and now we will start to create uh, our mess and now we need to create uh, our mess, our messing. Let's go to the messing inside, show the mess. Don't forget about that. He asking about uh, do we want synchronize now? No, we don't. Show mess, mess in place, uh, level, uh, ground level. It will be ground level. And now you should use the start end point, but I already did uh, the spline. Oh, I cannot, I cannot load the main spline anyway. Okay, I will do with you guys. Uh, just put uh, one point here, one point in the other side. Let's, I do like this. Cause I need the radius. Okay, now I have the sum radius. Revit automatically trying to help you, no worries. As you see, he giving to us some radius. I, I no, don't want here, I want a bit early, maybe here. Uh -huh. Till here. Okay. Okay, we get our spline. Now I need to uh, trim it. So I will use command uh, the trim till here. Oh, this one and this one. Now I'm select everything. I will go to the uh, mirror, big axis, this one already. Select everything, create the form. Let's go to 3D here. We now in 3D. One constraint. Okay, now this is our shape. Let's finish mass and let's synchronize this project. Now uh, I will go to the elevation view here and let's choose east part. Mm -hmm. Here, let's change the view to constraint colors. 
to see where is our missing. Now we need command di, di dimension. Let's put all dimensions because I should understand where is my commercial, where is my resident part. Okay, enough to here for now. I'll put here. Okay, so this is my commercial part, commercial, commercial till here. So let's connect it till this part. Okay, this is my commercial part. Now we need put the mm, residence part. Residence part is going till here, till level 34. Let's go back to the mm, ground floor. No, level one, sorry guys. Uh, we need now height. Uh, no, let's go to the level two. Actually, no, we need one more level. Uh, now we need to go to the view, view part here. Uh, here the plans, floor plans, and we need the uh, level, for example, 15 and level 40, 34. This one. Okay, with our levels, it's here. Now we need to change the uh, title is sheet. This is working drawing, and this one also working drawing. This is not coordination, this is architecture. Let's change it coordination to architecture and this one also coordination to architect okay now it's more easy for us nice let's go back to level one see I can see grids as you see but here we don't have any grids how come you will say because we need to go to the elevation and we should use the south view and as you see here, the our grids it not uh, going uh, not higher than level two, so we need just move it, not with command move, just with this, move it on the top, because our levels cannot see the this uh, grids. That's why I'm choose south view. Now if I will go to level fifteen, I can see my grids. Okay, nice. Now let's go to the sum elevation and check where our uh, residential starting. Our residential starting from level eight. So we need to add also one more view, it's level eight. Let's add one more. Uh, it's again on coordination because uh, it's like standard for us architecture. And here, working. Okay, we are here. And we need now put some uh, image here. Uh, let's go to the photos. And as you remember, this is this one. It's uh, our uh, residential, uh, typical residential floor. We need add here inside. Let's put it. Uh, it's not correct now. Now we need scale it. Uh, let's go inside and use some line. And this one, it's. Mm. Oh, it's here, yeah, it's so big. Okay, 900, like this. Uh, use the scale. Okay, now it's in the scale. And how to understand this is on the right position or no? We need to see the level one. Let's go to the level eight and we should see the level one under layer and level one and apply and now we can see the level one let's put it let's go to the level one and as you understand we have the here star case let's draw it with model line like this like this a picture, even picture, it's not so straight as you see. Uh, let's go back to level eight. Uh, 
uh -huh. now we can see the our uh, line uh, use command uh, move mv and move our staircase it's kind of but our um, picture it's not on the scale let's make it on the scale like this not let's try one more oh sorry um, scale yes um, it's a bit it should be okay done and now don't forget uh, I don't want to select pinned object let's go again to level 1 let's delete this line let's go back to level 8 and uh, change the I don't want to see the level 1 none okay and now we need to uh, draw this shape uh, now we'll go to the messing messing uh, messing place and this is will be uh, resident floors and let's try draw it again I think here it will be more easy because here not so much radius only this radius, this one, this one radius, maybe this, okay, and one more here. Let's put it here. And now I'm using the command uh, trim till here, like this, and here the same. Let's select all, um, mirror by axis. It's kind of, it's okay. Select all and uh, create the form. Let's go back to oh, finish mess and let's go back to 3D. And as you see, we get the other form. Okay. This is, is uh, our commercial part. This is our residential part. But uh, it's not so easy. F ah, yeah, everything okay. Uh, let's go to the east view. Mm check on click on the uh, residential part and let's extrude till till level 33 like this let's go b back in 3d so this is our core we're doing now core okay nice so and we, we need one more one more on the top let's check in uh, yeah, it's a bit smaller. It's a bit on the straight. Yes, it's this one. A bit smaller. Okay, we can create one more. Or we can forget about that. Uh, no. <laughs> Let's go to level 34. And now we need the picture number two, this one. Let's load it here. Okay. Let's go back again to the level eight. And now we need again the lines because we need to connect with our our staircase let's go level 34 again uh, under layer we need a level 8 here we are I use command uh, move from this part to this part uh, now we need scale mm. 
like this. Oh, perfect, perfect. Okay, now we can create the shape of this one. But before I'll go to the level eight and I will delete this line. Uh, level 34, um, I will pin this object. And at level eight, I will also pin this picture. So I cannot now move it. Uh, let's go again to the messing, uh, messing place and the penthouse. Doesn't matter. Uh, now, from this part to this part. No. From this part to this part. From this, this, like this, Okay, again use common trim till here, select again everything and mirror it, select everything again, create the form, finish, let's go to 3D. And as you see we get our penthouse, this is actually the size same, uh, anyway. Uh, we will go to the east view. Oh, it's exactly already at level 36. To make sure everything okay. And the same size, same size. Okay. Let's go back again to 3D. So, our core is done. Uh, our exterior view, I mean uh, exterior part with balcony, we can do also now um, or later. Better is to do later. Mm, okay, let's create levels. So for that, I'm choosing this uh, box, and as you see here, the math forms. Click on that, and choose levels what we want uh, create. To understand which levels we can uh, we can create, which can we create till level eight. Click on that, this one, till level eight. Okay, uh, actually level 8 we no need because uh, we will start level 8 from, yes, we will start from residential. This one no need, okay. Done, here, from level 8 to level 33. And this is last two levels. Level 34, 35, and this is roof. Okay, let's go back to 3D. And as you see, our level is already done. We can switch, ah, not, we will go to the messing inside, floors. Uh, let's choose the floor. Uh, let's choose the um, generic floor. Yeah, it's more than enough. Uh, and select everything, create floors. Now we're going again to the messing and show mess switch off. Now we can see only our floors. So now we can work. Now we will uh, create the uh, inside the plans, uh, the plannings, and also we'll create the columns because here no columns now. Okay, let's save our project. Synchronize. Okay. Few seconds done. 